Hey there guys, today I want to speak with you about my first rock pool, uh, how I've been doing after I found out that it was a rock pool and if I manage or not to, to get my money back. So try to stay with me and let's get into it and analyze a little bit how a rock pool is looking. Okay, so the name of the game, which let's say that lots of people they be in rock pool it's your hero well they were like early stages and <clears throat> red alarms all over when the developers they want to stay anonymous obviously it's my fault and i think everyone's fault for trying to invest in something when you cannot see the developers but again it was like the second nft game and i was quite silly and believed in I don't know in what <laughs> but yeah it was my second NFT game after Axie Infinity well <clears throat> I didn't tell no one that I've been playing Axie but yes I've been playing Axie I sold my Axies and then <laughs> searching for for other better stuff and because the arena it was like really awful anyway it's it's not about Axie today it's about uh, your hero. Okay, let's look. So this is how it's looking like. Oh, amazing, nice. They have the roadmap and everything. Mm, at the moment they are here, or they say that they are here, but truth be told, mm, the developers and everyone, they're off from like three months at least. They promise an update. It was no update. Then since then the market and everything is down, they drain the token and basically they slowly, slowly, slowly run. So I've been investing like $250 on the beginning because to, to be able and obviously mint an NFT, it was $50 in, um, in Binance chain. Yeah, again, Binance chain. I don't, I, I don't think that so many games in Binance Chain are are successful and the developers are running with the money quite often, but it might just be my, my opinion. Anyway, if we are taking a look, I've been minting almost the first NFTs from 35 to 40, I have more. I've been selling some of them and luckily for me, all of this money because you could earn uh, the token in game. In fact, the tokens, in the beginning it was just one of them, which it was YSC. So I managed to, to sell lots of it in good price. So I took back my investment. Some people, and I think the moderators and even the developers, I think they sold some of the characters for, for good money as well. But, I thought, oh, maybe I'm going to sell them for more money or who knows. But <clears throat> anyway, it's not about this. I'm glad I didn't do it just to, fool, just to fool someone else. At the end of the day, I didn't gain nothing. But anyway, they, it was just lots of wasted time. So if you ever come across this game, just trust me, don't try it. Do your own research. Like... Always I'm telling, do your own research, even if I'm telling like a game looks in a way, <clears throat> just go and check it out. So basically this is how their main token is looking like, it's from one day. And if we are looking to all, uh, we can see over here that at some point it was doing pretty good and then they sold and then they sold and then so on and so on until they drain everything. So yeah, quite amazing. And then with the YSC, with the currency that you are earning in game, or you've been earning in game in the beginning, uh, you can clearly see when they've been when they've been doing some stuff. They've been draining and then big big drain, and then still maintaining it and then boom. And then just running away with because they've been minting like 20,000 of them so around like 2 million so yeah good for them 
hopefully they will enjoy the money. I just wanted to do this video because I've seen lots of frustration on the Discord server and obviously on the Telegram. And I just thought, okay, uh, I will just I will just do a video about this. Again, here you can see the market as well. Everything is down. Keep in mind that most of them they've been bought or minted for at least 50 50 BNB or 50, uh, sorry. Uh, 50 dollars worth of BNB so yeah now it's like horrible but it's even pointless to to start something like this so yeah again it's taken some time until you're getting used to everything especially into this NFT space and until maybe you'll be lucky enough to do a little bit of profit because you know everyone is doing videos and things like wow we've been earning like thousands and thousands when in reality it's not that true when basically maybe you're just finding a good project you have some money you invest in it and then you are just earning like a good chunk of money or rather just some free to play game which are earning you instead like 10 20 dollars per month it's, it's still good, it's basically you're just trading your time for, for their, let's say, tokens. Okay, that's all I have to say. Thank you and have a good one, guys.